morning, lovelies. If I leave my house, if I leave my driveway in one minute, I will make the thrift store on time. So let's get it. We made it, you guys. I made it. I'm always in the market for a cute new hanger. skirts you guys and like every shade of color you can think of i'm gonna really have to pick through and see what colors i want they're not even should i get them it's a hard decision i don't know if they'll sell that great unless i mini them and that's a lot of work <laughs> Conrad immediately after I left the thrift because I was tripping you guys I couldn't even breathe I was so freaking excited but now we are at Costco I'm just waiting in line to get some gas I need to get some flowers Conrad's mama is in the hospital right now so we're gonna go visit her and bring her some flowers just to make her excited everything's okay she just needs to be in there for a couple days I'm just browsing Costco and all of the Christmas stuff is already getting marked down and we're in need of like a Christmas tree. So I'm going to start stocking the Christmas trees every week and see if I can get a good deal on one. All right, guys, we got the flowers. Uh oh, there was a car. Got the flowers. I also picked up um, a Costco puzzle because my friend is really into puzzles. So I got that for her for Christmas. And then they had these chargers i'm really hoping they're for the new iphone they're usb to c port i'm hoping that's the right charger it's so silly that apple did not give us chargers for our new phones all right lovelies i apologize it has been some time i got home um i kind of just picked up the house was kind of getting a little dirty I, I mopped the floors it's hard keeping it clean with these little guys running around but I don't think I'm gonna take pictures I do need to get ready and take like a full shower and you wash my hair but then I need to go to the hospital so I'm not gonna take pictures today I'm just gonna restart my depop day tomorrow I don't know I don't know we're gonna figure it out but um right now I need to get my flowers ready I'm gonna make my flowers I'm just gonna put them in this little vase I usually just put vases underneath the sink that I get gifted so I'm gonna use this one today I'm gonna wash it up and then make the little flowers for my mother-in-law and go visit her hello 40 he needs he needs his attention you guys you want to say hello you want to say hello 
Say hi. Say hello, everybody. You see that cow? That cow is very interesting to you, huh? So, yeah, we're going to make these little flower bouquets. We're going to pack our Depop orders. I only had three orders, which is nice. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, lovelies, let's go ahead and make this gorgeous little floral arrangement for my mother-in-law. Please excuse the tippy tappies. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm going to add in the food. A little secret that a lot of people don't know if if you put um, a little shot of bleach in the water, it works like it works like a shock to basically keep them alive longer. So since my vase is pretty tall, I don't think I need to cut off too much. Um, yeah, I think that would be good. I kind of like to do it like that. So I can know how much to cut off at the ends. And then I just start chopping. I start making like baselines and then, I don't know if you guys know, but to cut them at an angle because that helps the flowers um, drink the water better. And another good tip is to do it at kind of different lengths so the flowers can lay in the vase at different lengths, but around the same size that we're cutting off. When I was in high school, I was pretty heavily into FFA and we made flower arrangements. So I always get excited. I always get excited. What was that? It must be like the um, pine, like the Christmas. I don't know. That was hard to cut. Okay. Let's see how this goes. All right, I'm taking it off. I kind of like to just get the, like the prettiest flowers. Like there's a lily stuck down there. I'm just gonna pull it out. Make sure that it's getting nice front and centered. Should be showing you guys. I'm pulling out like this kind of just ugly little leaf. That's not cute. There's another little just pretty lily just kind of hidden down in there. And a rose, so I'm gonna pull those to the front to the center as much as I can. Maybe that was pretty. I need to bring this guy down just a little bit. He's on just like a little craft stick. Throw him back there, back in there. Cute. All right. And I think I have black ribbon. I wish I had red because it's kind of fitting the vibe. I wonder if I have like a gold. Let's see what I got. Yeah. It's looking like black ribbon, but that's okay. Is that cute? Yeah, I think that's gonna be cute. Cute. I can't complain. The bow kind of irritated me, but we, we got to do what we can work with. I bought non-wired ribbon one time, so that's what I'm dealing with. So if you guys really want like the true cute bows, you want to get wired ribbon. That's the trick. Ugh. All right, guys. Um, my neighbors are outside right now and they're playing music, so I'm really hoping you guys can't hear it, but I just wanted to do a little what sold on Depop. I had three orders come in, so not too bad, but our first item was these black, let me see the brand, just dress barn corduroy pants. Nice little, probably like 90s Y2K era. Hello, 40 Pop. Sure. She sent me an offer. I accepted it. And these sold for $20. And she paid the $7.75 for shipping. I'm hoping it might be not a full pound. Let's see, actually. Oh. 13 ounces. I don't have to put it in a flat rate. So it might be a little bit cheaper than $8 to ship. Our next item was this Trader Joe's. 
little long sleeve i freaking love it you guys i bought it as a personal but i never grabbed to wear it i don't think i like the longer thing the longer fitting items so i finally let it go um i actually just posted it last night and she sent me in an offer i posted it for 15 she sent me in an offer for 12 and i i took it i said kk and this was 575 in shipping so a little $15 order can't complain I feel like sales have been doing pretty good lately I don't know if it's because I've been like not obsessing but like I've been kind of focusing more on Depop and posting and being consistent I feel like it just shows consistency shows a great reminder for me to take freaking pictures tomorrow so I don't fall off the wagon on posting. Luckily, the last time I went and took Depop photos, I went a little ham. And I think it is because I knew I was getting going into Thriftmas. So I've been living off of those photos for a while. But I need, I'm running out. I think this next pulling round, I'm going to get like the last of like the really good winter bangers that I think will sell. And then... I'm not going to post any more like big grandpa sweaters, any more jackets. Jackets are basically done. Our next is this cute little bundle. She got this Western little jacket and I marked this down to 40% off. So she got it for a hell of a deal of $50. And then she paired it with this little jacket that was also marked down for 20 and then after the debop fees and everything i got 60 dollars and it's gonna take a box faux show i'm thinking i can put in the medium size like long gated box this bad boy is what i'm thinking i can fit it in That jacket gave me a little bit of a run for my money. I did not know how I was going to fold it up into a cute little boxy box. But we got it. We got it. And I'm going to throw this right here. Give it a little. Uh, uh. Beautiful. Eh. It's a little. It's a little bit of a tip. A tip. La, 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 la. It's a little bit of a tight fit, but mm. we'll, we'll get it. We'll get it. Okay. Beautiful. Gorgeous. I'm put a little tape on the sides. Doop, doop. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I also have a Poshmark order came in. This little Maeve skirt came in and that sold for $13 on Poshmark and the uh, Poshmark makes the buyers pay for it so not too bad easy little sell it honestly gives Poshmark vibes I thought it would sell for Thanksgiving but a little after a little after doesn't hurt all right seems as if the music is back on so i'll catch you guys a little later we decided to walk the puppy dogs down town because they have the christmas lights so we're getting all the christmas vibes today you guys I think I already found my favorite Christmas window. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. We decided to end the night with Boba. I'm just waiting outside. Conrad's inside ordering right now. Okay. It was a beautiful night. Me trying to get the dog's POV. Uh, 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 uh,